all you space engineers out there, Commander Kingfish here, and it is Mod Wednesday. Well, today's mod is TSO Enclosed Locks, and it's by the Slave One. Now, I've done a, other mods by uh, the Slave One before, and they're pretty good mods. This mod is mainly for uh, ships and stuff in space as well as on planets that uh, you need airtight uh, containers and what he has built is uh, a lot of uh, blocks that were not airtight and he has made them airtight now obviously that comes with a cost so they are a bit more expensive uh, to build but then again it might make it easier and it might save a few resources when you're building around these types of blocks so it, some of the blocks that he has are the uh, turret control gyro uh, the survivor kit uh, decoy a projector the gravity generator and the spherical gravity generator now these uh, come in large block and small block uh, not everything is small block I believe but uh, some of it is uh, both. Uh, you have, uh, as an example here, you've got your uh, yield module. Uh, this one here is your power module. And this one here is your speed module. So you can see he's got uh, bulletproof glass on uh, each side. And then this side will uh, attach to your refinery or your assembler so that you can use that. Uh, here's some look at the beacons uh, again uh, this is uh, one, one of the variations this is what is called enclosed beacon A and it looks like he's got the glass all the way around on this so it can be airtight uh, this one I believe only has glass on one side uh, but again because it does take bulletproof glass so these are your gyros. Uh, this one, uh, I'm not sure. This one is very expensive. 5,000, uh, actually 6,000 plates to build it. Uh, but then I think uh, the large regular generator uh, gyroscopes uh, take quite a bit of uh, steel as well. Uh, here is a look at the survival kit that he has uh, created. So they're all uh, very uh, well done mods. And if we take a look at the, uh, where, the where you pull your mods from or where you pull your blocks from, uh, you can see that he's got the enclosed antenna in a block. You can select those, but uh, here is the decoy. Uh, I didn't pre uh, place them all in that uh, I didn't want to, it would just get to be too bulky and too much. So you, you can take a look at that, but you can see here's, he's got them identified as the speed module A and the speed module B. Uh, so, uh, yeah, airtight blocks. I think it will help your builds uh, on your base builds on... Uh, low oxygen planets and stuff like that on the moon uh, and your uh, ship builds ESO enclosed blocks by the slave one check it out I think you'll uh, find it uh, interesting and it doesn't look like there's any uh, additional I think these are all vanilla looking at it so so yeah ESO enclosed blocks by the Slave One. Well, if you enjoyed this video, please hit the thumbs up. It really helps the video out a lot. And please subscribe. That'll really help the channel. And ring that bell. It'll let you know when I am uploading new videos. And I'm doing that on a weekly basis. All right, all you space engineers out there, keep your heads low. And don't get shot. And keep building away. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.